What is going on, everybody? It's your man, Mr. Homebrew. I've had a lot of projects going on behind the scenes. A lot of things I've been working on, um, testing, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to start getting a lot more content on the channel. I do apologize. There's been a lot going on in life. Not going to get into details on that. But here we are. We have the Surface Pro 2017 i5 processor. I think that comes with the 128 gigabyte or the 256 don't quote me on the storage size. 8 gigabytes of RAM. You can always check the specs online for the 2017 Surface Pro running the i5, obviously. Um, we got macOS Catalina running on this bad boy. I got five OSs actually running on this. I got Windows. I got Ubuntu Linux. And I got Catalina. I got two different Android versions running on this bad boy. They're running off another hard drive. I got... OS X running off of this little silver M.2 you see right there. Now that we're getting into focus, that's where I got OS X on Mac Catalina. And then um, I got my dongles. The Atzio is for Bluetooth. The TP Link, that other one in the middle there, that's the one I'm using for the Wi Fi. So, yes, you need a dongle for Wi Fi and for Bluetooth. Sorry, not my fault. But that's how it's working. And we're going to get this bad boy booted up so we're not wasting time while we're talking. See how quickly this thing boots up. Um, I am going to have a link and stuff in probably my next video or something. I'm probably going to make an installation video so people can see how easy it is to do this. And so they can get it running in a quick time period for themselves. Um, it's not too hard the way I got it set up. It's just a matter of installing... And then uh, install well installing the operating system a specific way using a specific config file that I'm gonna have in the EFI folder, and then um, you're gonna have to install a couple of programs, and then when you restart, boom, you'll have full graphics acceleration, all that good stuff. So I'm gonna show you real quick here. You can look at the at the sunset for a moment while I cover up certain information as I'm just showing you real quickly that something is working but you don't need to see all the information okay so there we go Mac OS Catalina right there Intel HD 620 1536 I did have it up to um, two th what was it uh, 2000 megabits for the video RAM but I changed that for now. That was just for the purposes of connecting to an external display and everything. But it's still working either way. So what do we got here? Um, we got the display. We got the brightness working. I'm sure everyone wants to see if that's working. Yes, it is. We got brightness. Good to go. When it comes to color profile, I've been recommending and using for myself this one here. If I go to the stock setting, you'll see the whites are just the contrasting right I like that a little more on those darks um what else do we got you guys want to see what's working evidently we got sound turn that right up so we can hear see so that's the sound coming out of speakers internal speaker blah 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 microphone working mic check one two three yes iCloud is working um iMessage is working i'm signed out right now because we don't need that i'm gonna have to make another account or something to use for demonstrating that but yeah you can download apps that's working i was able to download all of these so you just dance world of tanks asphalt 8 all that good stuff working 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 so not too bad there exit up there um, like I said, I do have Wi-Fi working for myself. I can open up Safari, I guess. Bang. There you go. How to open. Type Google. Or we'll just go here. Go to Google. Google. Both. So that's working. I could type YouTube and it would go YouTube. There's the recommendation. We'll just click on that and then go to the actual site. You'll see it's working fairly quickly. Bang. Good to go. Um, I'm not going to use, like I said, I'm not signed in, so I won't be going into the app store right now. But it is working. 
you can sign in and all that stuff. You'll be good to go. You will have to connect an external camera so that you can use, say, your FaceTime. Like I said, iMessage is working, FaceTime's working, but I'm not going to demonstrate that right now because I'm not signed in. And other than that, hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty impressed with the speed overall. Like I said, things are working pretty good. Load up the browser. Good to go. Load up a video on YouTube again. Go back to YouTube quickly. All right. Type Mr. Homebrew. Play a quick little video. I guess I could play one of my own videos if I wanted to. Show that the audio is Where working. Ah, what's with good. the ads? I don't want no ads. I'm going to have an ad in an ad. Uh, or... That's not going to work. Here, let's get rid of that for a second. We'll mute it. We'll block off the ad so we ain't watching no dumb ad. And we'll get right to the video. There we go. Let's show that the audio is working. Figure why not? <laughs> dive into Got the body all fall the way. Video. Turn that down a bit. But it is working. Go to full screen. PS4 Bang. Jailbreak. Got it running at... 1080p right now because of the resolution I have the screen at. If I change the resolution of the screen, then I'd be good to go. So yeah, that's working. What else do we want to show working real quickly? Yeah, the battery just shows full. No matter what. Still trying to get that resolved. At some point, we'll get that resolved. Bluetooth's working. No complaints there. Um... Bluetooth. Yeah, I have my Xbox controller running. I was playing some games, streaming some games. And yeah, more details to come. I hope you like, subscribe, share, and all that good stuff. I'm going to start showing you guys some more projects that I got going on. Going to have Android running on the Nintendo Switch most likely coming up next. See you guys soon. Peace.